Here's the key to getting a good circle wipe transition in Adobe Premiere Pro. With your two clips next to each other on the timeline, you want to head over to the effects panel and open up the video transitions folder. And inside the iris folder, you should see the iris round. So this is just your classic circle wipe. You can apply this transition in between two clips like so, and it will play out like this. But the key is to making it good and customizing it is we don't always just want it to expand out from the center. Here's where we're going to click on this little yellow piece of transition tape and open up the effect controls panel. And here you have your A and your B clip. And you'll notice there's this little circle target on the A clip and you can move it around so that you can make your circle begin actually wherever you want. So in this case, because we have this clock tower, it's kind of nice to make the circle expand in or out from this clock circle. So I can move the pointer over there. You can also choose to reverse so that either it expands out or closes in the circle. And you have a couple other options such as border colors or making it start a certain amount in or not. But I'll just, I'll just keep it mostly default except all I did was adjust the circle position from where it begins and ends. And of course, if you want to make this transition longer or slower, you can make the tape further or closer together. But now that is a very easy way without having to go into the effects panel and use the circle effect and keyframes to create a custom circle transition that expands out or closes into whatever point you want. If you enjoyed this video, my name is Justin Odisho. You can subscribe for more. I also sell transition and effect packs on my website, justinodisho.com shop if you want a bunch of custom transitions that I've created. And I hope to see you in the next video. Thank you for watching.